I was thinking about possibly putting dart traps in here facing this way. What do you think? Maybe, you know what? Let's leave this open for now and leave the possibility to dart traps. What's up, zombie slayers? This is KG48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for 7 Days to Die Alpha 17 Vanilla Series. Welcome back, guys. Okay, so here's the deal. The horde base needs to be worked on. There's no if, ands, or buts. There's nothing to talk about. The horde base needs to be worked on. That's what we're going to do today. I took some graph paper to work today, and I drew up what I want the four tower def the five tower base defense, whatever horde, the five tower horde base defense uh, setup. Right? You know what's funny? When I was planning out the five tower horde base defense, it was actually nine towers. There was going to be two towers on each side, two, four, six, eight, and then the middle tower would be nine. I don't know why I thought it was five towers, um, but I actually have adjusted a little bit, and the towers are have have morphed. All right, the towers, instead of being towers, are now going to be L-shaped, like, almost like walls, and then I'm going to put towers on the corners. It's going to, I'm going to try and make it look as medieval as possible. Uh, I'm going to get all medieval all over the, the zombie's ass, all right, because, uh, you know, last horde night was not to my liking. Uh, F you, Steam. Anyway, so yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be working on the horde base. I need to get some uh, uh, some wood. Now you might be thinking, well, what are you going to build with wood, Cage? I'm not building anything with wood. I actually need wood to cook with because I found an iron node. Uh, well, actually, one of you guys find an found an iron node and told me about it. So thank you very much. And I'm going to show you where that is in one second. Let me just go ahead and plant a bunch more trees here. And then that way we don't have to go super far for trees anymore. And let's go ahead and grab the uh, motorcycle. How much wood do I have left? Eh, 500 is pretty decent for now. Um, I'll cut more wood off camera. I just want to show you where this mine is. Oh, it's so sweet. It's so sweet. So I'm just going to come right over here. How is that? Yeah, that's going to have to be picked pretty soon. And check this out. Look at this. Huh? How close is that? Right? Look at that. Huh? And all I got to do is mine down. What, what I did was I came up here. One of you guys told me about the mine, the, the ore up here. So I started digging down. And like a few blocks down, I found iron. So I'm going to make this little like walkway going down. Hopefully the zombies will come down the walkway if they sense me down there. I don't really know how that's going to work. Uh, but the first thing we need to do is we're going to need a lot of concrete. Like a lot of concrete. Um, because I'm going to get to work on, uh, I'm going to get to work on the five tower defense, man. I'm going to, I'm going to really put in some work today. We're going to need to set up some uh, concrete. We are going to need to set up some, or some cement. We're going to need to set up some rebar. Um, we're going to need rebar corners. Let's see what we got here. Rebar. We need some rebar frames, 118. I think we need some corners for more. Uh, I'm gonna, uh, no, actually, you don't need that many of those. It's mostly going to be these. Yeah, let's just go ahead and make 122. There we go. We got some more uh, iron being cooked. That is wonderful. We're going to come over here and we're going to make some crushed sand. Let's go ahead and make 999, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 999, oops, that's not what I wanted to do, uh, 999, 1, 2, so it'll be 6,000 sand, all right, and uh, I have a lot of, uh, I have a lot of stone, because when I was looking for all that iron ore, you know, I was just, I was just going through stone, you know, uh, so let's go ahead and get this cooking as well, and let's put some more in here. And let me go show you. Let me go show you where that iron is, and then I'm gonna get some iron. I'm gonna get some wood. I'm gonna get a bunch of stuff off camera, and then we're gonna be building. We'll probably be building during the night. What is that? Is that crickets. We're probably gonna be building during the night, but I'm okay with that. I'll just turn up the gamma so you guys can see. Should not be a problem. So check this out. So I don't know how I want to do this though. I don't know if I want to make this a. Honestly, I don't know how I want to do this because I want to make like a little walkway down for the zombies. But at the same time, um, if you make a little walkway down for the zombies, they won't use it. If I'm like, let's say I keep digging on an angle here, right? And I keep digging and I keep digging and I keep digging. And I end up like, oh, I don't know, like over here. Like, let's say I'm, I'm down in the mine and there's like iron right here. The zombies will probably dig down from here instead of coming over here to the entrance. So that's what I'm worried about. But at the same time, I'm not that worried about it. Um, we'll deal. We will just deal.
All right, guys, we're walking out of there with, oh my God, a stack and a half of iron. Hells to the freaking, yeah, that didn't even take that long either. And I hope you guys enjoyed the mine lapse. I haven't done one of those in a while. Um, a lot of new people probably don't even know what the heck a mine lapse is. They probably don't know what was going on. Um, yeah, sometimes I do these mine lapses where I just kind of, um, uh, well, mine lapse, build lapse, whatever. I'm going to throw some music to it. It should be a lot of fun. I think you guys will enjoy it. Uh, you guys have been really enjoying that um, that quick cuts with the zombie kills. I saw Glock 9 do it, and I was like, that is really cool. And um, I want to do it more often. It's just, um, it's hard because it takes a long time to edit, you know? And, like, I put up two videos a day, so it's really, really difficult for me to find the time to edit that kind of stuff in. But when I will, I, when I do have the time, I definitely will because I really enjoy those videos. I think they come out a lot better like that. And uh, people tell me in the comments, they enjoy it as well. So that's cool. Um, I also don't have any steel to repair my pickaxe. So, but I was hoping the pickaxe would last for the entire mine lapse, and it did. So that made me happy. That made me happy. How much um, frames do I have? Probably going to need a lot more frames than that. So let's go ahead and make... We don't need 300 frames. Let's go ahead and make another 100 frames. You can never make too many frames. Hey, man, if you make too many frames, burn them. <laughs> you know, it's perfectly fine. Nothing wrong with that. So, all right, we're just going to go ahead and cut this one down. And I think we'll be good for a while. Uh, yeah, it's about 800 wood. That's not actually a lot of wood. But it'll it'll be good for now. Go ahead and just plant these again. I don't like to do the, um, I don't like to plant uh, trees by my horde base, but this is not my horde base. It's just my regular base, so that is just fine. All right, let's get back. Let's get some steel made, right? Because we need some steel. Oh, I also started making a crucible. Uh, I got to get to level, what, 70? And I'm only 55, so we're not going to be making steel tools anytime soon, but we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. And we got to hit that farm as well. Because I have not been paying attention to the farm at all. And that is a mistake. That is a mistake. And it could be a painful one. You know? Uh, do I have anything in the bike? Uh, nothing I really care about. Well, not, not nothing I care about. But nothing that I have to take out of the bike. Alright, let's see what we got going on here. Alright, so that's going to need more clay. So why don't we do this and this. And this. That's good. And we'll just put that in there. We'll take that. We'll take that. We're going to need more spikes. So let's just go ahead and make some spikes right now. Because there's no reason not to. Uh, spikes. We're going to need a lot of spikes. Let's take the crucible. And let's throw that in there. Crucible. And then let's go ahead and make some steel. Some forged steel. There we go. 63. Alright. Some other things we're going to want to make today is fencing. So, electric fence post. Oh, we can't make that yet. Oh, crap. I didn't realize I couldn't make electric fencing yet. Damn it. That's like level 60, isn't it? Ah, and we got to put points. Oh, God. We have to save our points and put them in intellect. I need intellect 8, which will cost me 3 points. So, I need 4 points total. I think I'm 55, so I'll have just enough if I don't put it in anything else to put it in intellect and then in advanced engineering for electric fences and blade traps. Okay, well, you know what we can make? We can make some dart traps, right? Okay, so we need to forge our mechanical parts and electrical parts. Have I made any dart traps yet? I want to say I haven't, but who knows? Maybe I have. All right, guys, so I'm going ahead and making up a bunch of concrete mix. Then we're going to take this concrete mix, and we are going to turn it into arrow slits. Uh, 22? Yeah, that's actually not too many. Not even close. That's probably not enough. That's that, actually, that's definitely not enough. Um, <laughs> I also have this thing making up uh, forged iron, some cement. It's got iron in there. This is still making cement. Um, we're looking pretty good here. Now, there's something I wanted to ask you guys. What am I missing here? Now, this is probably something really obvious, but I don't know. Maybe it's not obvious. Maybe it is. I can't tell you. But, yes, yeah, science. One of five. Okay? Yes, yeah, science. One of five. Okay? Spiked knuckle schematic. Where'd it go? Spiked knuckle schematic. Schematics are used as ingredients to craft high-tech modifications, weapon, and armor. Requires yes, science, tier one. Yes, science, tier one. One of five. Yes, science, tier one. Okay. Tier one schematics. Okay. So, um, spiked knuckles. Why can't I make these? What, what am I missing here? I must be missing something. Maybe... I don't know. I've got the I've got the knuckles. 
I've got the steel. I've got the duct tape. I've got the scrap. I don't know. I, I feel like I'm missing something obvious. I wasn't even going to bring it up because I don't want to be made to look foolish. But I really want to know what I'm missing. Even if it's obvious, just let me know. Hit me with it. You know, just let me know in the comments. All right. So let's go ahead and drop all this stuff off in here. Uh, that's pretty good. I want to bring some more food with us. We're going to do something about food. We haven't been doing anything with food. Oh, yeah. Really quickly. I also went out and made myself a poncho. Why didn't I think to make a poncho earlier? I don't freaking know. Eh, what are you going to do? It's just the way it goes sometimes. Uh, let's bring some soup with us as well. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to check the farm. And then we're going to head on out to the base. And we're going to get we're gonna get working, man. we got to get that horde base ready. I'm not going to have another horde night like last time. This is not going to happen. Um, I wish I could just disable Steam. But I can't because I don't, I don't think you can play games with Steam disabled. So, all right, guys. Uh, is this thing all ready? Yeah, it is. All right, let's do this. Forgot they broke down my entrance. Freaking scumbag. Damn. <laughs> Hate them. Hate them. Let's let's make this entrance up first. First and foremost, we don't have to we don't have to deal with this again. Hopefully they won't break they won't break it out when it's reinforced concrete. I don't know. I'm not really sure why they went after it. I mean, I wasn't on it. I wasn't near it. I don't know. They just they might have that frenzy thing, you know, where they just go crazy and start attacking everything in the area. I really don't know, but it kind of sucks. So let's just go ahead and take care of this. I think we need one more, right? Yeah, one more, and there we go. And then we'll just have this come out one spot. And there we go. And then we will have this be wood. So in case it collapses again, we don't lose what we you know have down, or it's only wood at least. Come on. There we go. Okay, now we can get back up. Well, damn it, how am I supposed to get down without breaking my legs? I think I can make that fall without breaking my legs, so it shouldn't be a problem. Did we get any of these uh, bars in here knocked out? We did not. That is pretty cool. That is pretty effing cool. I'm not going to lie. Uh, especially with the, when I got those cops, I started getting a little nervous, you know? Uh, can I make this drop? Well, there's only one way to find out. Actually, no. I'll show you how we make the drop. Oh, that's how we make the drop. That is not how I wanted to do it, but, you know, it, it worked out. It worked out. Uh, we're going to put this two up. Three... Four, five. We just need one more. Let's just complete this now. There we go. And boom. Okay. All right. So um, I have this all written down on graph paper. So let's go ahead and put down the blocks where we're going to need them. Um, I've done this before anyway. So it doesn't really matter. So I'm thinking one, two, three. That's right up the middle. It doesn't matter. That's right up the middle. Okay. One, two, three. One, two. And I think that should start... Right there, so I'm thinking here and here. Is that where that is supposed to go? I'm gonna look at my little piece of graph paper here. Oh, hold on, maybe I'm not. Get out of here! It's not just one, is it? I'm not sure. Seems okay right now. All right, so it's supposed to be three out from the wall. So one, two, three, so that's right. And three out from the other tower. So the other tower will be here and one, two, three, and here. So that should be where it's supposed to go. Um, this is going to be three wide. So that goes like that. One, two, three. And then this is going to go over like a bunch of spots. All right, and so is this. This is going to be like a big L-shaped tower, basically. Uh, it's going to be a big L shape. And then what I'll do is I'll put a tower up in the middle in the corner. Um... If, it make, if that makes any sense. When I was actually building this on stream the other day, when I was like marking this out on stream the other day, or maybe it was in a YouTube comment, I'm not really sure which one, someone mentioned I should make it in an L shape. And I didn't know what they were talking about. I was like, L shape. And I just didn't get it. But no, they are right on about that. That would be a really cool idea. And that's what I'm going to do. One, two, three. Uh, one, one, two, three. So that goes there. No, that goes there and that goes there. Whoop, I heard something. Oh, there you are. I just hope they don't bother me when it's nighttime. That's the only thing I'm worried about. All right, guys, I think I've got this worked out. So we're just going to bring this right over here. I don't know if this is perfect, but I think it, I think it is, honestly. Uh, one, two, three, and then that will go like this. And this will come this way. All right. And that will come this way. And that's the idea. Let's go take a look at it from up top. Just so you guys get a get an idea. Get a bird's eye view. 
And I'm gonna go ahead and grab some food while we look. So that's the idea right there. And then I think I'll make... See how it's going to be like a big wall? And then I think I'm going to put dart traps in, in here, shooting that way. Dart traps in that one, shooting this way. Dart traps right there, shooting that way. Um, this area right below me is not going to have dart traps. But what it is going to have is I'm going to put either shotgun turrets in here or uh, maybe blade traps. I'm not really sure how, how I'm going to do that yet or what, but I haven't really decided. Um, I could always hang the blade traps from the ceiling. Um, I could always put shotgun turrets in there basically if the zombies get into this area there's going to be no dart traps shooting them um i could put dart traps right here you know um but the thing is i won't be able to put tripwire going this way because there won't be any place to put it uh unless i leave the tripwire exposed which i don't think is a good idea um now the other thing i could do is i could put dart traps here and leave them on a on a switch and then I could flip the switch when I want them on. It's another possibility. I don't think I want to use all dart traps. So I think it'd be cool to use some different, some different things. Um, you know, different traps and everything. So let's go ahead and leave that alone. And are we committing? Now comes the scary part. Are we committing? So I'm going to have... I'm going to have a dart trap here, here, and here facing that way. Right? Um, and then what am I going to have over here? Uh, I could put this, I could put that below it. Yeah. The thing is, if I, if I commit, this could be painful if it's not, if it's not exactly the way I want it. Um, and I, I am going to want some, uh, some electric fence going from over here in the corner to over here in this corner. Um, I want an electric fence right here that will go over here and through into there. And then one right here that will go through into there kind of like on an angle. And I think that'll work out okay. Is there any reason I'm going to want to put dart traps? Or I don't think so. I think we're going to commit here. I think we're going to commit. It's always scary when it's time to commit, guys. Oh, yeah. you, 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 um, bachelors know what I'm talking about. <laughs> uh, is there going to be any on ground level? I don't see why there would be. Um, all right. You know what the hell with it? You only live once. There we go. We just leveled up. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. We can't touch it. We can't touch our skill points until 60. I'm just gonna, I'm not even going to do anything with them until 60. Okay. There we go. Oh, there we go. Go a little faster there. Oh, don't do that. We want to make this a ramp. Nope. What we do here is we go to on face. There we go. Much better. Maybe we should probably we could have probably dug out the ground first, but that's okay. That is a okay by me. All right, and that's the uh, that's the floor plan. That is the floor plan. So before we forget, let's go ahead and put the uh, let's go ahead and put the arrow thingies in here. We'll do it from this side. There we go, and that's going to be dart traps. And this is going to be dart traps. So I think you can see what we got what we got going on here, guys. There's going to be dart traps here. And then there's also going to be a trip wire and electric fence going from here to this tower. And we're going to have dart traps shooting from here that way. We're going to have dart traps shooting from here that way. And we're going to have dart traps shooting from here this way. Now this, my friends, is a mother effing kill zone. Okay? This is a kill zone. Uh, you know what's, You know what else I want to know, guys? Can, can shotgun turrets shoot through... Uh, Shoot through arrow slits because maybe instead of doing all dart traps here, I could do shotgun turrets as well. Might be a good idea. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Uh, is that a good idea? Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. Who knows? I've had good ideas. I've had bad ideas. Let's go ahead and copy rotation. Okay. Copy rotation. There we go. And copy rotate. Oh, don't have to copy rotation there. It was already set up. Um, oh, boy. This one's not... Ready to go. There we go. Is that? No. No, that's not right. Uh, on face. So you guys can see what I'm doing with this, man. I think this is going to be a hell of a base. I I'm not going to lie. I think this is going to be a hell of a mother effing base. Right? Okay. Now, I was thinking about possibly putting dart traps in here facing this way. What do you think? Maybe, you know what? Let's leave this open for now and leave the possibility to dart traps. Actually, 
what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it open and I'm going to do some research. You guys, could, could you let me know in the comments, can shotgun turrets shoot through arrow slits easily? If not, I will probably close this up and not put... I mean, I can always put dart traps here too and leave them on a switch. So I'm not really sure. You guys let me know, what do you think? Should I put dart traps there and leave them on a switch or not? Now, some people say to use... Um, I could use... Uh, who's he? What's this? What are they called? Um, motion sensors? Maybe, maybe. I don't have a lot of faith in motion sensors, to be honest. Now, one thing I know that this is going to be a solid wall in the back. There's no reason for the back not to be a solid wall. Because the idea is they're going to they're gonna come in the middle because that's where I'm going to be. Hopefully. You never know with this freaking zombie AI, right? <laughs> it, it does the weirdest crap. Man, I can hear some zombies out there. And I don't want them coming in during the night. But I also don't feel like going to look for them. So to hell with it. Let them come in during the night. Alright, so there we go. So let's go ahead and put another layer on top of this. Let's get this all the way up. How much... Uh, oh yeah, we still got a decent amount of concrete left. Well... Yeah, we do. We actually have a decent amount of concrete left. All right, well, let's go ahead and put this up. Let's just put this all the way up. The hell with it. Uh, ah, damn it, cage. That's not the button. Copy rotation. So we're going to bring that all the way up to there. Do I want to bring it up to there? Is that... No, there's no reason. There's no reason not to. Not that I know of. I could just bring that right over like that. Yeah, it should be fine. Yeah. Okay. That looks good. That looks good. So we'll bring this over like that. And then let's get this thing all the way up there. We're not going to be able to reach it, though. That's the problem. It's going to be hard to upgrade. But that's okay. We'll get it done. Okay. Oh. All right. I can't wait to see what you guys say about the shotgun turrets. I actually went into my um, Discord and I asked. So I'll probably have the information before you guys tell me. But you can still tell me if you want. I read all my comments, so... Yeah, I want to know if uh, if shotgun turrets shoot through arrow slits. That is going to be just a freaking beast, man. It's just going to be the best. Can't wait. Copy rotation. Okay. I don't think we're going to be able to finish this today. We're going to run out of time. It's okay. It's okay. We got a lot done today. We got a lot done today. And we're just going to load this. I mean, everywhere you see where there's, where there's floor, there's going to be spikes. I'm going to put spikes everywhere. I mean, like, spikes do the work, but, man, when they break out... I mean, you saw what happened last Horde Night when my, when my spikes were gone. It was just, you know, that was the end of me, right? That was just that was just GG no re. So, let's go ahead and upgrade these. Okay, looking good. Looking good. Awesome. I don't know what I'm going to do next video. I, I probably will not do a building video next video. I think I want to go out and uh, stomp some zombies in the freaking skull. You know, that might be pretty fun. Find out why I can't make those spike knuckles. I'm still, like, it sucks because, like, a lot of times when, like, I'm, like, really confused about something. Like, why can't I do this? Why can't I do that? There's always an obvious explanation when people tell me the explanation. I'm like, ugh, it's, like, such a dumbass, you know? Um, so I'm not looking forward to the explanation, but I want to know because, you know, if there's something I could do to make those spike knuckles. I heard they're, like, ridiculously strong. You drink some beer and you go out there and you start punching zombies and it's just, you know, it's just, it's a freaking good time. Good time is had by all except for the zombies. Um, so I'd really like to know uh, what the deal is with that. How much do we have left? Uh, oh, we still got a decent amount left. That is nice. That is really nice. Probably want to paint this thing too. I don't really find the painting options in the game that good to be honest. I really don't. I locked myself in here, didn't I? Of course I did. Why wouldn't I have? No, yeah, it's okay. Not a big deal. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'll probably put in some kind of... I don't know. There we go. We'll just do that. And then we'll do this. There we go. And then we'll do this. Beautiful. And then we'll do that. What the hell did I come up here for? I don't freaking remember. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, I remember. Yeah, we're still upgrading. Shut up, timer. We're almost done. Uh, up. Copy rotation. There we go. Got to get as much of this done as possible so I can get a real sexy screenshot. There we go. Okay. Do, do, do. Upgrading. The rebar frame. 
I'm running out of concrete. But not soon enough. This stuff actually go goes for a while. Yeah, it's, concrete lasts a lot longer than you think. You have like 2,000, you're like, eh, it's not really a lot. But no, it's a, it's a pretty good amount, honestly. Okay. Oh, damn it. There we go. And there we go. All right, let's finish up out here. Okay, guys, I think this is going to work out really well. The kill zone is going to be nasty. I think the next uh, the next one we're going to make is going to be over here, and this will be the kill zone. Um, although it probably I probably will not have all four kill zones ready for Horde Night, but that's okay. We're just going to do one Horde Night next time. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold myself to that. So anyway, guys, if you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Can we get one like for everyone who thinks that this this freaking tower wall kill zone is just going to be phenomenal. What do you think, guys? I think it's going to be phenomenal. I hope you guys do too. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.